Mixmax can help you save hours in email each week. I'm going to show you a few of our most popular productivity features. So we're starting with this email that we've written to Judy and we're saying send the files by Wednesday. Now suppose we're writing this on the weekend and we want to send this later. We want this to send on say Monday at 8 a.m. So we can easily schedule this email to send in the future. Click schedule mail and this is just going to go to our outbox and it'll automatically be sent at the date and time that we specify. So that's one way we can save some time. Another option is to, um, to automatically remind ourselves to follow up. So we need these files. What we can do here is set a reminder and we can add a note to this reminder. Maybe the notes to call her. If we don't hear from her, if, you know, if we don't get a reply by say Monday 3 p.m., I can set a reminder. So this time comes, she hasn't replied, this email is gonna pop to the top of my inbox and remind me to follow up with her. Now what if I just totally take myself out of this equation and I set MixMax to automatically follow up with her? So let's do that. Again to the automate menu at the bottom here and this time we're choosing schedule follow up. So we're gonna use a particular sequence here, follow up version one. And I can say again, if I don't hear from her by Monday 3 p.m. I'm going to add this sequence. Now watch what happens here. You can see that these are the three stages of the sequence that have been added here and she's going to receive them on these particular dates and times if she doesn't reply. And here we can click to edit this and, and really customize this. Um, so this is just a great, great way to automatically follow up with her and take out a lot of the mental stress of having to, you know, have to-do lists and following up with people. It just happens automatically. Um, other productivity features. Let's go over a couple of quick keyboard shortcuts. So I'm going to start with templates. I'm going to use the semicolon command here to insert a template. And I'm using a template here for my phone number. So that's just inserting a chunk of text that is uh, my phone number. You can insert all kinds of stuff in templates. We have tons of resources on, on how to use templates as well. Um, let's see. Another thing we can do is add some um, some times to, to meet. So I'm using slash meeting here. Uh, let's do 30 minute meetings here. So this is just pulling from my calendar 30 minute meeting slots when I'm available. Very, very easy way to set up a meeting instantly. That was slash meeting. Now here's a fun one. Let's look at using a poll. Uh, we'll use the yes, no question here. So this is a great way to drive action, to, to get people to reply here because people love to click buttons. We can say, uh, ready to save time in your email. So here we'll insert this question. Um, a very quick and wonderful and interactive way to, to get someone to reply there. So those are just a few of the ways that Mixmax helps you save time and be more productive.